What's up guys, Eric Harmson again, obviously Team Rex. We're back again here shooting another bowling ball review at beautiful Spectrum Lanes. And uh, today we're gonna shoot a review on the new Hammer Purple Urethane. Purple Pearl Black Urethane. Awesome. This is what I'm talking about. This is a 78D, guys. This was made for the tour players. Just because they have one doesn't mean you can't throw it too. I've been using this a lot on sport conditions and I'll tell you what, I really love it. Great step down from that purple hammer, or as I call it, the purple slammer. So let's go ahead and shoot a review on not only the black hammer, but let's see how it compares to that tried and true purple, guys. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button below and we appreciate everyone, thanks. He says we're ready, let's roll. Black Hammer Urethane, the Pearl um, 78D, obviously made for out on the tour. Um, something I definitely wanted to drill up. The Purple is a great urethane ball, but it's a lot of ball. And sometimes I just need to step down from that. So this is a great compliment to that. Today, we're gonna show you the difference between the Black Hammer uh, Pearl and the coveted Purple Hammer. Let's throw this at about eight at the arrows. Nice. Again, this is gonna be more of a tame, you know, pulled back ball than that purple. So here's what we're gonna do. Everybody likes comparisons and we wanna clearly show you guys the difference at home. Uh, this is a real review. And uh, so we're gonna pull out the purple hammer, coveted by pretty much everybody. We're gonna do the same thing. Throw that over eight. As you can tell, that ball is simply more. It's more up front, it's more overall than that black hammer. We'll swap back out to the black. We're gonna do this a couple more times. Switch out my Jopo, it's as easy as that. Pop it out of one, put it in another, forget about it. Don't ever, ever have to worry about that breaking. We're back to the bl uh, black hammer, excuse me. There's so many bowling balls, I gotta keep it, you know. Remember, back to the black hammer, and let's make a simple move right up 10. Well, we tugged that. And again, weaker ball, weaker ball motion. The ball's gonna sit there. It's gonna be very predictable, guys. It's not going to uh, be, like I said, as big as that purple. We'll do the same thing. Let's swap back over to that purple hammer, or as I like to call it for ease, the purple slammer. Try to hit 10 here. We did. Ball went high. I've got these two balls drilled similarly. Uh, we'll get you the numbers on all those, of course, as well. So you can see for yourself. I have already used this ball on several different sport shot patterns. Uh, just last weekend, I had a bold one that was on the 2016 Masters pattern. I believe that was 39 feet and a medium to higher volume pattern. I ended up using this right out of the gate for the first three, three and a half games. Um, obviously took the lane out of play for me, made it easy to score. Um, and also the big, uh, biggest thing for me is leaving something that's actually makeable. You know, it's not a big reactive ball that's going to hook and leave me a ton of splits or a big mess. Let's go back over eight here at the arrows. Missed inside. Strike. I love this ball, just me personally. Again, it's that step down from the purple. I feel like I can really get after this ball. I don't have to be so sensitive with my hand because I know at the end of the day, this ball is only going to hook so much. It's gonna be strong up front, like all urethanes are. 
but it's a lot weaker after that strong up front uh, motion. It's gonna be much more tame as you're seeing here. Throw another shot, up eight. <clears throat> Even when you twirl the ball, you get 10 down with that hammer. Throw a couple more here, guys. I think you're starting to get the gist of this. It's clearly a step down. All right, we're gonna make a move here. Let's move left. Let's throw this over about uh, 12 or 13. There is a no-go with this ball, just like any other urethane ball. Again, it's gonna be big up front. It's gonna be pretty much forward off that. So that being said, Let's show you the purple hammer now. Throw that same area, around 12, 13 at the arrows, purple hammer. Give you a quick comparison over strength of these two balls. Purple still made it back to the head pin. Again, not the best shot in the world, trust me. Uh, these conditions don't give us optimal, you know, performance with urethane here as a fried house shot. Um, but, uh, you know, guys, appreciate you guys watching this. Hopefully give you a little insight into that uh, Black Pearl Hammer 78D. Just because they made it for the uh, tour doesn't mean we can't throw it. Like I said, I've already thrown it on multiple sports shot conditions, and I continue to. My bag for those is going to consist of that Black Hammer and that Purple Hammer. And don't forget about that NU. That's going everywhere, too.